want to ask them a question. Maybe I'll start with you, Lisa. What do you look for in a pitch? Oh, where do we begin? Okay, so I look for absolute passion and purpose and a sense of your why. That is my absolute number one. And then for me, it's how you can articulate and get the message across to me as succinctly and quickly as possible. I can go on and on, but I don't want to take away from whatever one else. It's horrible to be asked first, isn't it? <laughs> You want me to go on? I have hours on this stuff. Johnny? Yeah, uh, for me it's really about energy and the person behind the idea. I think that, you know, everyone's got a great idea, everyone's got mates that'll sit around, you know, having a couple of beers and, oh, I could do this, yeah. if I could do that, I could start this business, if I only, you know, that successful business over there, that was my idea that someone else took and ran with it. I think that, you know, an idea is 5% of it, really. 95% of it is the person behind it that's going to go and execute that idea. And uh, so I, I really look at, you know, who is this person pitching me? Do they have the energy to not only just have the bright idea, but to then go and put the blood, sweat and tears into actually turning that into reality? And then when someone else, like a rocket internet or the light, you know, sees the good idea starting to take off, comes and goes, we're going to come and throw truckloads of money and beat you to the punch. You know, do they have the, the passion and the drive to beat that person, you know, through, um, through man hours and just hard work? and gritting it out and I think that that's probably for me the most important thing is passion and hard work and someone that can actually do the job. Uh, Craig, you see lots and lots of these, you tell me. Yeah, we, we see about a thousand deals a year in my team, so the first thing we look for is just some interest in the game, because actually it's very dull when you see a thousand sort of boring conversations. But, so, but in, within that, authenticity, some connection with a problem you're trying to solve and something that means something to you. So, you know, uh, second, some crisp thinking, you know, just how do you get to the uh, sort of complex problem and try and sum it really crisply. And, and thirdly, loan limitations, you know, we're not all everything to everything, so what are you good at and what else do you need support in? And you see lots of them too, Trevor, Come, what, what's your yeah, go? Yeah, they're all, I mean, you can't add any much more than that. I guess the, the simple formula is, you know, identify the problem and make me understand that problem. You know, what's the solution you're going to have to deliver that and, you know, why are you qualified? And uh, certainly, why do I want to help you and spend lots of hours working on your business and, and investing money? Yeah, so I agree with that, and I agree with everybody else. I mean, obviously, all those things are included in the solution. To me, it's problem, solution, problem, solution, problem, solution, problem, solution. That. And you're going to have 60 seconds. These guys are going to get 60 seconds. So in 60 seconds, you can't say much. You know, a 30-second ad's 23 words, so 60-second ads have 46 words. So you've got 46 words to identify the problem and give us a solution straight up.